Hello, welcome. This is the Twisted Sister Vlog Hop. And if you don't know what a vlog hop is, it's right here on YouTube. And it's instead of a blog, you're going to hop from video to video. Um, I'm Lori Cooch. So if you're starting with me, there'll be a link in the comments of this video, not the comments, the description of this video for you to then hop on over to Trina Warahana is the next um, uh, vlog in this grouping. And there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven of us. And six of us, sorry. And each video is gonna be around 10 minutes. And the purpose is to show you a fun and different way you might not thought of using one of our products. And today I'm going to show you our pinwheel. Um, die and what I have done with the pinwheels is I've made like a little flower place setting um, I know our neighborhood during the summer we get together a lot for neighborhood barbecues and stuff and perfect after this COVID mess is over um, it'd just be a fun little thing to have on our tables at our next barbecue so I'm gonna show you how to make them let me set that aside First thing I'm gonna grab is my cuddle bug. Um, a big shot would work, or if you have the close to my heart one that was a hostess reward, that will work as well. Then I'm taking, um, this is the die, and it's a magnetic mat that I have it on. So I'm just gonna put it on there, and I have pre-cut a piece of paper. And honestly, all I used for these were scraps. I just went through my scrap bin, <clears throat> excuse me and picked out some scraps so I layered that on there I'm gonna run it through if it makes noise it's okay and then when you take it off this is what you have I'm going to move this out of the way. Now, I have acrylic nails, so it's a lot easier for me to do this with a pair of tweezers. So I'm going to sit down to do this because my nails already make it hard enough. So, this one's not too bad. Some of my brads were kind of already split apart so if that was the case I just kind of took my tweezers and bent them a little bit so that they were together you can see this is the negative side this is the front side so you just put your brad oh can you hear my dogs in there and just gently fold it over and then start bringing in your pieces of the pinwheel and tucking them onto the brat. And this is where I said, if you have nails like me, it is probably easier to use a pair of tweezers, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep going. I'm hoping you can see this. And you're just tucking them in and lining them up on your brat. And then once you get them all on, there's a hole back here and you just line it up, push your brad through. I use my tweezers to, um, oh my gosh, separate them. Of course, when someone's watching, I look like I don't know what I'm doing. There. And that is um, your pinwheel. Super easy. Kind of just fluff it up because I smooshed it down trying to put it together. And then next I took, um, I had just a stash of these wood floral stakes for making flowers. And I'm just going to try to figure out how to make it so the pinwheels could spin. And I just couldn't come up with a way, but if they're decor, you don't really need them to. So I'm just gonna take a thin piece of painter's tape. I have this in my craft room 
all the time. It's just scotch painter's tape. You can use it on everything. And I'm going to put my put this on my dowel and then put it to the back of my cardstock so that it gets the whole the whole dowel in there to hold it in place. And that is my pinwheel. And I can add it to my bouquet. I gotta arrange them because they're all different heights and sizes. And then you have a, the fun decor item. So there they are. And um, like I said, I just used scrap. And to be perfectly honest, making all of these prior to starting the video, maybe took 15 minutes. It was so easy, so fast to do. And the hardest part was me with those silly brads and my nails. But um, that's it. That is my project for the vlog hop. Um, of course, this is intended to be used on cards and scrapbook pages, but you can always use our projects or our products for others as well. So this will be a home decor item. Well, driveway item because it will be on our table for a barbecue but I can always put it up later kids would love it and this would actually be a fun craft to make with kids because it would keep them entertained for a while so hop on over to the next vlog it's Trina Wirahana thanks for watching be sure and circle through all of them you'll you'll know you've completed it when you come back to me and if you haven't already please click subscribe and you will be notified every time I make a new um, crafting video for you. So thanks for watching. Enjoy the vlog hop and have a wonderful, wonderful evening.